Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is gonna be a general flip through of my number 12. So, um, I don't know how long this video is gonna be, but you know, get yourself a cup of tea or coffee and let's just get started. So, on the front, I have a photo of BTS as usual, then on the back, just some random stickers and photos. This is a Dean sticker I got from my friend. You wanna focus? Okay, there. And then my Kumon sticker. This is a photo boot sticker, but the photo started to fade. And then this girl sticker. So <laughs> this journal didn't take me that long to finish. I started it on um, April 9th and finished it on April 30th. So not long at all. So <clears throat> as usual, I just have a bunch of stickers on this side, on this page. And then I have any stacks on this, on um, the square. <laughs> Um, I just like to put it in stacks and it fits perfectly, so just have that. This um, journal, you'll see that I used a lot of watercolors, so that's why, I mean, it didn't bulk up more than usual, but you can see that the pages are more squiggly. <laughs> so this is the front page, or my first <laughs> entry, I guess. You see that a lot of my pages look the same. It is basically the same throughout the journal where I have a photo on one side and then writing on the other. And I used to say that uh, my spread, they look, I mean, they look exactly the same, but the photos are different and what I write is different. So in the same way, it's not the same, <laughs> but yeah, anyways. So I have a photo of Jungkook, JK. And then song lyrics. So I think in my previous um, journal flip through or journal with me, I can remember, um, I said that I had a bunch of photos from Euphoria, but I didn't want to write about it because I was at the end of my journal and I wanted to write about it in here. So I did. And then the lyrics. And then more euphoria. This is like what my, my, my thoughts. <laughs> so you can see the difference between my thoughts and lyrics by how I start the sentence because you can see that all the sentences start on the same line. As of here, I kind of alternate where it starts. So you can see, you know, the difference between a personal thought and, and like a lyric, song lyric, quote, whatever. This, I don't know if this is vellum, it kind of has this coating on, and it kind of like, it looks like powder, but I don't know, but it's really nice, and it's not as see-through as vellum, so I wrote, about, wrote a quote here, and then something there. I started doing this a lot in this journal, or a lot, I have like three pages of it, where I use Alice's date stickers, and then I write like, it's kind of like daily journaling, but what I like about, um, you know, doing it this way is that I can decide how much, um, I, you know, how much space I use for each day. I kind of like a bullet journal because you can see here on Wednesday I wrote, you know, this much, but then on Monday I only wrote this little. So I'm not like restricted to one certain amount of space that I have to fill out, so I really like that. <gasps> They're so cute! Roll it a little like this. This is the um, Pentel Fude Touch Pen, brush pen that I use. 
oh here i don't know if you can see but i kind of made a mistake and then i started writing on this line when i was supposed to skip a line so i just took um some grid paper that i had and stuck it over This day is uh, was the um, tourist in your own city event in Oslo, where basically like museums and attractions and stuff they were uh, you could get in for free, but you had to have this pass um, to do so. And <laughs> me and my friend we had or my friend she already like pre-ordered tickets so we could have it on her phone, but I wanted the pass so I could put it in my journal. So we went and got it, and I used these stickers, these um, sticky pockets, the 023, and then I just stuck it in here. So now I can use them. I mean, you can't use the pass over again, but now I don't have to, you know, I just have it in my journal, and I knew that I didn't want to tip it in, so this came in handy. This fits in there nicely. Uh, more of the weekly or daily journaling. And I still do that. I have a new journal now. And I still do it. But I use my date stamp. I don't know if you can see. I use my date stamp instead. Not as pretty, but it works. And this is when I got happy me from Alice. I don't know by the time you're watching this video if I, I have uploaded all the journal with me from this journal yet. So, you know, <laughs> if I have, I will leave it, you know, in the eye up there. This I actually did film a journal with me for, but I didn't like how it turned out. So, you know, I deleted it. This is a fan of a post. More photos. And then this is actually vellum. And um, I originally had it so it tipped in like the other, but I don't know, it kind of um, like bold. No, what's the word? It, it flipped up like no matter what I did, it didn't lay flat like this like with this one it just kind of went like this every time I turned the page so I just taped it up but I didn't tape the whole thing so it's still kind of you know interactive this is the lyrics to lovely by Billy Eilish Eilish and Colleen really like the song really nice their voices together so please check it out, I will be a link to it down below. Oh yeah, this page, I originally had this day on here, but I knew that I wanted to continue having the week, you know, spread out like that. So I tore it off and then, because I already um, drew the line, I just ripped it off. And then this I really like, um, I wrote some thoughts on here, it's not like private thoughts, it's not like you can't read it. Uh, but I just kind of wanted to conceal it a little bit, so I drew on a piece of alum and then stuck it over. And <laughs> funny thing is, here I wrote about like um, my anxiety because I have I've been feeling very jittery, like very on <laughs> on calm. Because okay, this might sound stupid, but um, there was an article that said that BTS would have a world tour after they come back. And I'm like, oh my god, world tour, there's no way because it's so soon. Well, joke's on me because the next week, on April 26th, they announced they're gonna have a world tour. And <sighs> the anxiety comes back, the flashback to when I tried to get tickets comes back. And yeah, <sighs> okay, so I need to calm down. Okay, I'm calm. I'm collected. I need to drink my tea. Oh, that's hot. Okay. Anyway, so <laughs> kind of laughing at myself because I wrote about 
a possible world tour and then yeah. but I want to do more of this where I write and then I draw on a vellum so, yeah. this was not intentional like I didn't plan on putting this over uh, because if I did I wouldn't have like put this sticker so far out and I would have done it so it fits underneath the vellum but I think it looks all right and then like I said on this page I wanted to have the date out like that and I think yeah okay so um, dun -dun -dun, nothing exciting on this week um, we got a confirmation that BTS will perform on Billboard and then I use another one of these sticky pockets but on this on the disc I actually wrote something if I can get it out okay it's not a private thought I just want to use this space <laughs> so what about um, this um, pastry shop and how I always pick up a business card but never use it so I have it there now I have it in my journal So this was National Book Day, I think, and um, I finished reading Shakespeare and Company, the book about Shakespeare and Company, it is such a good book. Um, it is like nonfiction, which is my favorite genre, and I don't know about you guys, but I like, uh, I like books <laughs> that has uh, a lot of photos. Um, I would show it, but it kind of holds up my lamp. Over there so if I can I will like pop out some photos from the book it's just a really nice book so um, I wrote the um, quote that says I created this bookstore like a man would write a novel building each room like a chapter and um, I like people to open the door the way they open a book a book that leads into a magic world in their imaginations George Whitman, founder of Shakespeare and Company, Paris. So I really like that. And then I uh, realized that I had some book paper that was in Fr um, French, which was perfect because the book or the bookshop is in Paris. So I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. So I did that. And again, the vellum kind of flipped up all the time. So I just stuck it and I still can do this. Hey, home, baby. This is a log, my favorite log from Jimin. Um, if you guys don't know, logs is kind of like vlogs, but it's basically them sitting in front of a camera and talking about everything and anything. So this is my favorite of Jimin. Uh, actually, <laughs> I have it downloaded so I can listen to it before I go to sleep because his voice is so calming it's like better than ASMR it's just it's so calming I don't I mean I like this page I just don't like how my writing looks it looks I don't know not as neat as I wanted to and this um I actually did the color first and then I found this photo and I don't know about you guys but I really like the way it looks the color just match and this is my final page kind of dark um, these little browns and dark colors but you can still see what I write hopefully so yeah that is uh, my journal absolutely love this it is if i haven't said it already my favorite insert so far and as you saw i'm already in a new one and started on the same day or technically or i mean <laughs> when i wrote this page it was like 2 a.m so technically it is still the same day 
And I was actually gonna f um, journal me doing the first page, but um, I was not home, so that didn't happen. That is my journal slipper. I hope you guys liked it. If there's any questions about anything, please don't hesitate to leave it down below. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a good day, good evening, good night, wherever you are. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye!